Connie and Curtis. I hate any sort of confrontation or drama. Okay. I try to avoid that at all costs. You do. So much so yeah. that I saw my neighbor, and this isn't even confrontation, but this is like how I like to avoid drama or anything <laughs> like this. I saw my neighbor okay. at Meyer the other day and had to avoid going down the aisles that she was in so I didn't have to say hi to her. And that's How's not that a, drama? I, I, that's just... I. That's any sort of that's confrontation to me saying hello to someone. I hope that's out. socialization. I know, <laughs> and that's how much I want to avoid that type of stuff. You got to do it to your uh, new puppy. Yeah, you got to do it to your very weird. You got to do it to yeah. your kids. So, Interesting. You got to do anytime, it anytime. I got to go out of my way to do something. So if you saw me <laughs> walking down uh, walking down the street, you would like duck into a store. Uh, I'd say fifty fifty. Wow. <laughs> wow. Even Curtis. Like, even I mean, us, you would? Well, not you, Connie, but sometimes uh, Curtis says, like, I don't want to deal with this right now. <laughs> and that happens. I get that. I get uh, that. I, I'm like Pigpen. I have a whirlwind. Well, you of, see coworkers uh, and me. stuff like that. And it, it was funny. We were talking, I was talking with some female coworkers, and we were talking about how when you were like grocery shopping or you're doing, you're out shopping, doing something out yeah. in public, and you see coworkers and you're like, I'm going to go the other way. Oh, okay, so it happens. Mm-hmm. It some, happens. Some, some, yeah, people do do that. Okay. Yeah. Some I don't might see you all the time out, Curtis. You do. <laughs> <laughs> and I said, people probably oh, do, but yeah. they just don't want to. I uh, it, It's funny. <laughs> I, I think that that's probably true because I will see like a coworker and then you like see the run. Of them? No, I will run up to them and be like, oh, hey. And they always are like, oh, yeah. Oh, you're here. Like that does seem to happen yeah. a lot. So they probably have seen yeah. me and are definitely trying to avoid that whole, that whole scene. I'm blown away by that. I don't think I'm that bad. I think I'm good. No, I mean, I said 50% Well, sometimes you're in a hurry. Sometimes you don't have time to do, to sit in hand, especially... I find yeah. I will do that if it's somebody that I have not talked to in a long time and I'm in a super big hurry. Okay. It's like, I don't, I'm sorry, I don't have time to sit and talk. I, okay. I would love to. We need to catch up, but I cannot do it right so now. So you will find your way down the frozen food aisle. No, I don't avoid them. I still say hi to them and stuff, but. Hi, I don't have time to talk to you anymore. Do you do it where you're like running past? Like, hi, oh, <laughs> good to see you. How are you? No, Crazy, I don't do it that huh? Way. And then you're grabbing things that you don't even need. <laughs> what? You're, you're just willy nilly, like, oh yeah, I'll take no. this uh, this encore uh, this encore lasagna that feeds twenty people. Yeah. Ooh. And then you're running as fast as you can no. out of there, and then you get stuck in line with them. So you've already talked to them in the store. <laughs> well, the, okay, like, so here's the weird thing about I, I get to the store yeah. and. I always go to the way back and then start in the back and then go towards the front yep. of the mire. Okay, mm-hmm. back to and front. I am doing that and then about second, third row in, I run into my neighbors. It's full family. It's the mom, the dad, and the daughter. Okay. And that's when I'm like, okay, I'm making a turn. I'm, I'm going to go back to the front. Yeah. And I'm going to start shopping from the back way so I don't have okay, to say hi to them. to back. Which means you're yeah. still going to run into them at some point. Eventually. Well, you could. Then you could. Sh- the... Wife decides to go to the deli counter, so uh, I'm at the front, and she can see me at the deli counter. We make eye contact a couple of times, and then uh, I'm avoiding this, and I, I feel uh, bad by the end of it because after you like avoid it a couple times, you you think to yourself, you're like, well, I can't go up now and be like, well, I've been looking at you for 20 minutes, yes, trying to can. avoid you. Just now say, say hi, hi and keep walking. No, well, it gets or worse because oh, then we both God. arrived at our houses and we're right <laughs> oh. next door to one another at the same time, so we're both unloading <laughs> the Meyer. Groceries at the exact same time. Oh, oh you were there? Yeah. <laughs> it was so Steve, bad. Steve, you made it so way more awkward that than it needed to be. You I should always do that funny. type of thing, too. The first That's time you funny. see each other, just say hi and smile and keep walking. You don't have to stop and talk to every person you know. But what if I or see you? recognize? What if I see you, Connie, and yeah. we are we're acquaintances? It's not like you and you and me, right. the two of us, where we. Hey, like, we how get, you doing? So, but Good. Let, let's say that happens, okay? That's and that, what I would do. That happens that first time. And then yeah. I. We're on the opposite path. So I see you hi again. like eight or ten <laughs> hi times. Hi again. And then you start laughing eventually. You just keep saying hi. And then we're standing you next to each other at the checkout. How does that go? Hi. And then I just turn. Yeah. And I start reading a magazine. You just keep saying hi. Because we're at checkout. And then you laugh. It's not awkward. It's just okay. hi. I feel, oh my gosh, here we are again. I feel like we're trying mm. to help Steve. Gosh, I've missed you. Overcome overcome this. So he should have said hi every mm. time he saw them. I would have. I would have started laughing. And That's then, what I would do. Should he have bagged their groceries <laughs> no. and taken them inside for them? <laughs> no. Because that would have been nice. No, but if you just would have said hi the first time, it wouldn't have been awkward ever again. Okay, so You, would have, you both would have kind of started laughing. So after say that. hi the first time. Each other. Does that make sense, Steve? 
I know it's uncomfortable yeah, for you. Yeah, I still probably wouldn't do it. I oh can't God. get over the fact that you see me downtown and you like go in a store to avoid Well, me. it's only 50-50. Sometimes you would say hi to me. Sometimes I would say Have hi. you ever avoided him? Curtis? No, I haven't seen Curtis out in public yet. Okay. Thanks. Mm-hmm. <laughs> That's nice. Okay. That's the nicest yeah, thing so I think Steve's ever said. Percent, I have not yes. avoided zero you. avoidance. <laughs> zero I have avoidance. actively avoided people in this building. They no longer work here anymore. It was the old secretary, and she was super sweet too. How do you avoid someone in the building? And there's no, no one exit. I, I admire again. Oh, I and, and she say, even oh. used to like. Right when I moved up here, she felt bad for me, and so she would give me leftovers. She and would? I avoided her at oh. the Meyer for some reason. Teresa. Yeah, Teresa. Yeah, I was just uh, you way to call her I out. Saw her. Curtis, you, you hate, Teresa, I love you to death. You hated I, her? I, I, no, because whenever I go shopping, I always have my headphones in. And so oh. and Steve is socially uncomfortable. You yeah. are. I am socially You're socially awkward a little bit. But you put the it headphones takes in. Me, like, I'll, I'll be really outgoing to, towards people after I get to know them. Okay. But for the first short part, right. period of time, right. I'm very reserved. It's not natural for you, and it's no. not natural for every, but for a lot of people. You know, not everybody mm-hmm. has. Not everyone's Curtis. Natural. Was it right. weird? <laughs> was it weird for you then, Steve? Uh, Steve and Brittany had a couple's uh, wedding shower two weekends ago, and Katie and I went, and it was. I don't think anyone at that party knew more than one other couple. Am I right? Like, there were not people who all hung out. No, no, yeah, yeah. That was pretty pretty accurate. Was it weird for you to see all of us talking and, like, getting along so well since you were so bad at that? Yeah, it was just weird for me having to be the center of attention there, too. That's what my mom said. uh, (laughs) Steve doesn't like that. It doesn't come natural to you. My mom said several times, she's like, I think this is the most I've ever seen you drink. (laughs) (laughs) Connie and Curtis.